All right, welcome to the stage, your next comedian, Zach Schneider. How's it going, everybody? Yeah. So, uh, my wife, she can be kind of silly sometimes. I showed her this song the other day, and it was a sad breakup song. I just like the sound of it, but when it got done playing, she's like, please don't leave me. <laughs> I'm like, you have got to stop being so insecure. And she's going on and on about how it's different because I wrote the song. <laughs> I do write music, uh, and the first song I wrote was a breakup song. <laughs> and uh, I was so proud of myself that I had to show somebody. Um, so when my ex came to pick up our son for her visitation, I, I played it for her. Uh, and apparently that was a really insensitive thing to do. <laughs> uh, I was unaware of it until she left crying. <laughs> I, work, I worked at a factory at the time, and I really, I really hated that job. And it's, I ended up getting fired from that job. It's the only job I got fired from. Uh, you know, I thought it was a mutual breakup. <laughs> you know, they were tired of me calling in and I was fucking lazy. <laughs> I'm just glad that when I picked up my last check, they didn't sing a song about how much better they are without me. <laughs> That would have been rude. I learned how to play the guitar when I was about 15. My grandpa said he would give me a guitar if I learned how to play bluegrass, which I did. And as a 15 year old, that's probably one of the most embarrassing ways to learn how to play guitar. <laughs> it's like learning how to fuck from your cousin. <laughs> Yeah, you got the experience, but no one wants to hear that shit. Yeah. I like bluegrass, though. Gets my cousin in the mood. Uh, so my wife, she likes to watch crime shows. And, uh, anybody like crime shows? Yeah. <laughs> I saw a meme that said, don't mess with me. I've watched so many crime shows I can make it look like Santa Claus did it. And if there's one thing I learned from crime shows, is that if I wanted to get away with murder, I'd just kill somebody that was arguing with their spouse. <laughs> the point I'm trying to make is, you know, love your spouse, don't argue with your spouse, and especially not in front of me. <laughs> you guys ever grab a cup out of the dishwasher and use it? <laughs> And only to find out that every fucking thing in there was dirty. <laughs> and I have a joke for that. I'm just, I, I did it a couple months ago and I'm still pissed. <laughs> Bullshit. I was thinking earlier how crazy it would be if I, if I had a heart attack on stage. You know, like, like nobody would really believe me. You think I was doing a bit. But especially after me just saying that, <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Playing a risky game with that joke. <laughs> so yeah, I, uh, I got a smartwatch a while back, and I got it in hopes that it would help me get into shape. <laughs> but it uh, it keeps on recalculating, saying things like, you know, baby steps, you got this. <laughs> week after week, it's lowered its expectations, and if I've learned one thing from the past, I'm about to lose this watch. 
it's gonna leave me for someone with a thicker wrist. <laughs> like my last time piece. <laughs> anyway, that's all I got, guys. <laughs> Keep it going for Zach, everybody. Yeah.